Hi, I'm Rocky Nichols, and this is Funny Guy Food Reviews. Today, Smiling Fish Brand Fried Mackerels. In the little tiny can with a pop top. I'm liking that. Ingredients, fried mackerels, water, sugar, palm oil. That's different because usually they use olive oil. Chili, soy sauce, salt, and vinegar. And there's a disclaimer that says, contains fish. In parentheses, mackerel. No preservatives added. They even give you the 1-800, they even give you the website, smilingfish.com, where you can tell them what you think of their product. I like the fact that it's the small can, it's got the pop top, and it's got this cute little symbol on the bottom. That's a nice touch. But what's good about this is you can pop the top, you can tip it upside down and drain all the oil, preferably into a container, not on the floor. And that removes a lot of the oil and the calories. The usual precautions, disposable paper plate, saltine crackers for texture, disposable fork, and I'm gonna to try today one of these bamboo pokey sticks to see if I can skewer them and pull them out of the can. But be careful, you can poke someone's eye out with this. Also, plastic bag to wrap it up, throw it all away, and paper towel in case there's a emergency. So let's give it a go here. Always concern whether it spews out juice from the top or sucks in air. We always want it to suck in air. That's not a good sign. Hmm. Let me try this with a little bit different. Ah, it did have a little tiny air movement. Well, let's see if we can pull that thing off. <clears throat> so far, the top is not cooperating. May need to use some heavy equipment. Not recommended. Really not impressive when you have to use a pry bar to open the container. Looks like they're packed in there like sardines. I don't think I gotta worry about them falling out when I drain the can. There's the chili sauce. Oh boy. The fish are in chunks. They did fall out. Well, there's one down in the cup. Try my little skewer out. No, that ain't too bad. All right. Well, as you can see, covered with chili sauce. Now, there's definitely a 
bone in there, a rib bone or something. There's no scales though. But it is fried. Now mackerels are a lot like sardines, but seem to be a little bit bigger most of the time. And when you get fried mackerel or fried sardine or any fried fish put back into the can, it you those looks kind of burnt like this. Burnt, dried, smoked. Usually they are a bit drier and chewier. But let's give it a try. As usual, it has an unpleasant odor. A lot chewier than I expected. Pretty tough. Good chili flavor. And it's sweet. You can't detect the bones. You can't detect any scales. Not bad at all, other than it is chewy. Let me try another one. Let's see if we can pull it right out of the can. I would say my technique needs some improvement. It's not working. I guess accessing them from the can individually is rather awkward. It's probably better to just dump them all out on a plate. I just don't like that. I like to take them out one at a time. Now, Here's a rather healthy individual, and it looks like we can fillet this one and see what's inside. Not quite as appetizing because you can see the bones. But, as I said before, and if you've ever eaten these, the bones are usually not that detectable. In addition, I finally figured out why I always have to have saltine crackers or something similar to eat this type of food. It's because the crackers take away the texture of the bones and the scales or anything else that's left on the fish that you wouldn't normally want to eat. Disguises it, sort of. If you want, you can remove that right out of there, most of it. That looks a little more presentable. Just like the other one, a little chewy. But I really do like the sweet flavor and the light chili tang to it. It's not overbearing, not too hot. They really have a good mixture of the two flavors. I would say give them a try. Small portion, about a buck and a half a can. Not so convenient to get them out of the can and the lid not popping off was not impressive, but it may have been just an anomaly. Otherwise, smiling fish people, check into that canning system you got. I'm sure that it's easily improved. Thanks for watching.